and here's a quick lowdown on some of the changes that are coming to the GUI uh, to make the more the uh, the features we have more approachable. Uh, one small change is the symmetry tool now uses a proper drop-down panel instead of a drop-down menu, uh, which lets it stay on screen if you wanted to make uh, changes to it as you're working. It makes it a little easier to work with, and uh, you don't have to keep dropping it down every time you want to make every time you want to make a change to it. You can just do it right there on screen. So that is just one small thing uh, that's coming. And as I said before, the uh, the post correction tool also now has a proper drop down, uh, which is right next to the symmetry tool there now. Uh, also, some nice presets built in. Uh, and I've said before, there is the option to use this with the curve tool now. Uh, formerly, it was used with the paintbrush, but now you can also use it with the curve tool. So, say we draw using the curve tool, we can automatically or uh, not automatically or automatically have it. Uh, do that for us. Whoops, let's see. Using this button right here, you can do it automatically or we can do it manually uh, if we so wish. Right there. Alright, so those are just a few changes coming. Thanks for watching and ta ta for now.